Morning guys, hope you're all well. Um, this week's art challenge with Donna. I thought with it being um, breaking up on Friday um, for half term, so and while we're off, um, it's going to be Valentine's Day, so I thought it would be nice for you all to make a Valentine's card or a picture um, for somebody that you, you love. All right, so it could be mums, dads, grannies, granddads, boyfriends, girlfriends, anyone you like, okay? But first of all, um, for those who want to try this, we're going to make a love bug, all right? And all I've done is I've got some paper and I've cut it into a heart shape, but it's been doubled over so that when we open it out, it's like a butterfly, heart, heart, heart wing butterfly, okay? And then I've got a piece of card or paper and we've cut it into like a body. Right? And he's going to stick there. Now, unfortunately, guys, I can't glue because my kids have used all my glue and I didn't realise until this morning. So we're just going to have to improvise. I'm going to have to put it down and I'll show you at the end, OK? And then for his head... I've cut out a small love heart and we're going to stick that on the top of the body. So just about there, like that. All right. But then in his body, I thought we could write something, something nice. So you could, um, you make me smile. Um, I love you to the moon and back. Um... Just I love you, things like that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna take a pen and I am going to write. Um, And I have brought I love you with some little hearts around. And we can colour the hearts in if we like, okay? Um, reds, pinks, whatever colour you want, whatever your favourite colour is. And you can write anything you like in there. It doesn't have to be I love you. All right. Then I'm going to bring my butterfly alive, my love bug. What, what we can also do as well... I've got a picture here from what I was looking at. Okay, so if you want to, you can do your handprint in paint and put it onto the sides of your picture, like that. My hand won't fit, it's too big. Um, or you could draw paint little love hearts or stripes, dots, anything you want, just some little patterns, just so it fills the Fills the um, the wings so it just looks a bit more less plain. All right, and then I'm going to get some pipe cleaner. Okay, and I forgot my scissors, so I'm going to run and get some scissors, guys. Okay, I won't be in a minute. Right, I'm just going to cut just some little strips. We only want two, okay? And I'm going to bend them at the top. Just at the top. Just like that. So they look like little candy canes. Okay? And I'm going to stick them underneath my little heart. Like I say, guys, I will show you in a minute how they all should be positioned, okay? Just with me not having glue. I'm very disorganised, aren't I? And then I'm going to give my little book some eyes. So I've got some little googly eyes. They've got different shapes, different sizes. Might give them some big ones. And I'm just going to place them on there. Okay. So... This is how it, it should look, guys. I don't know if it's going to be upside down. 
or I think we need to do it this way, don't we? Oh, this is technology, me guys. Oh, right, let's have a look, see if we can. There, so it's going to look something like that. Okay, but yours, your wings are going to be nicely decorated and all colourful. All right, so that's that challenge. For the next challenge, if you'd like to do a card or a poster, you have been given pieces of white card, tissue paper, red paper, pink paper. So you can do it however you like. You can just do an A4 poster with lots of nice nice things on. I love you. You make me smile, things like that. Um, lots of hearts all over. A picture of someone special that you, that you, um, you want to make. Or you could make a card. So by folding the A4 paper, card in half, and then putting a, pa um, a picture on the front, and then inside writing to somebody who you want to send it to. Okay, so that's all for this week, guys. I thought I'd get you something easy, and I didn't want to start doing cards to show you how to do them, because I think you're, you're all creative, and you all know... And what kind of things people like all right so from after half term when we come back we're going to start doing some some fun and different challenges all right and i'm going to go through them step by step with you and we'll make them together all right well have a lovely half term guys stay safe everybody keep close to your family and i'll see you all after half term okay bye